share this for a while. Deborah comes from the word debar, which is word, and which is where the w Greek word logos comes from, as when it says that the word became flesh, and it's talking about Jesus. Um, well, the bar is the Hebrew equivalent to logos, and Deborah, De Deborah means a bee, Isaiah 7.18. Um, it goes on, it says, a bee, a wasp, Arabic collection, um, collective, a swarm of bees are wasps. And then um, it says, the Hebrew word, however, is a noun of unity from the unused and um, so right here, it tells you to see um, the bar. Well, if we go over here to the bar, it actually explains that this root has various significations, of which several are only found in the derivatives in Hebrew, but which in the cognate languages also appear in the verb. These various meanings may be thus arranged. The primary power as the etymologist in Holland long ago rightly observed, is that of setting in a row, ranging in order, kind of like a beehive, right? <laughs> to lead, to guide, especially to lead flocks or herds to pasture, to rule, to direct a people, to lead, to rule, also to bring into order, to subdue. And then right here explains, see if Phil compares swarm as if a herd of bees, and Deborah, a noun of unity, a bee, which see, as a shepherd follows his flock from the idea of leading, there arises that of following. So the B is what I'd like to focus on now. And we know that God's word is a light. And um, from the Ark of Titus, when they carried it off, and they depicted them carrying it off, the golden candlesticks, as it now appears on the Ark of Titus. And you see right here how it kind of juts out, and then it juts out here and juts out here. What it's explaining is that they believe that it was in the shape of a hexagon, like bees. Bees build their nests in the shape of hexagon. And as Christ fed us with the words of his mouth, and God, Yahweh, feeds us with the words of his mouth, Jesus said that I am, he was saying that I am, that I am God. Well, Language is traditionary. Language is passed down. Language is something that we inherit. So, um, right here, this is actually um, usual representation of the golden candlesticks, the R's being all in the same place. So, I hope that you found that interesting. Um, all right. Y'all take it easy. All right. Bye.